Hello, ladies and lads, and welcome to the Baby Patch. If you're new, welcome. If you're not new, welcome back. I'm Dee, and this is my adult doll channel, and not meant for children. These dolls are for collectors only, and not meant to be play toys. To find other collectors, please click on the names in the comment section of this video. Today is, what is today? Let me see, I think today is hashtag whatever I want Monday. And that is hosted by myself, D, here at the Baby Patch. And for whatever I want Monday, we have my big grumpy boy, Cameron. He's the Cameron Sculpt by Laura Tuzio Ross. His artist is Alicia Willis. His length is 23 inches long. His weight is seven pounds, two ounces. He has a full vinyl limbs and head on a doe suede body. He has open brown glass eyes. His lashes are applied and his hair is rooted. He's a gorgeous boy and the biggest boy in my nursery. And he hasn't been happy since he got here. <laughs> That's a long story. Uh, I'll have to tell my newbies. Um, today we are going to change Cameron into this beautiful romper by Pat Pat. It's white, yellow with, a, well, it's white with a yellow sunburst in the left, on the, le across the left shoulder, it has two snaps on the shoulder, and then it goes down to uh, green specks, and then down to green with white specks, and it has a, a baby yellow giraffe, yellow and brown. It has a baby ti smiling tiger, which is outlined in orange with brown colors. It says jungle party. The tiger does. It has a yellow lion with orange trim. It has a white zebra, black and white, with green legs because I guess it's all stained up from grass. It has a dinosaur with white scales. And it has a black and white hippo on the leg. And on the back, <laughs> it's green at the bottom, white at the top, and it's got a black and white monkey with a bunch of bananas. And he says, hello, in yellow. And we're going to put these shoes. It's the only ones I could find. Um, it has kind of a, a reddish color on the side, a yellow on the back, has green around the toes, and the rest of the sneaker is white. And he's missing a bell. Going to have to find that. And let's see. Cameron is grumpy because when he got here, we had left the day before for vacation. And we were going to be gone for a week. And I waited forever for this boy. And I thought, well, you know, if he hasn't come yet, I want you to snag my blanket. If he hasn't come yet, he'll, surely he'll hold off. And I thought that I called the artist and told her not to send him until, you know, we got back. And I forgot to get him any socks. But obviously I didn't or she had already sent him one. Because the next day after we left... Who showed up? <laughs> Mr. Cameron did. Cameron laid out on the front porch because we've got cameras and I kept an eye on him. Um, laid out on the front porch in his box all week in the rain. And I believe it was in the winter time. In the rain and the snow. The raccoons tried to, tried to carry him off. The cats tried to open him. <laughs> And by the time we got home, he was not a happy boy. And he hasn't recovered. <laughs> it was, it was, oh, it was nerve-wracking all week. Knowing that baby was out there on that porch. And I thought about, I thought once about, because we were only like two hours away. We were in Pigeon Forge at the rod run. But I thought once about coming home and getting him. And then, uh. I thought, Lord, I'll never, 
I'll never get out of town uh, as busy as it was, as crowded as it was, or get back in town <laughs> till it was time to leave. So I left him there. It was, like I said, it was, it was nerve wracking. Uh, let's see. I need to take this. I need to take all this off of him. I love these diapers, but every one I've got looks like they're for a six-month kid, a six-month-old. Uh, let's see. Trying to find him some socks. Everybody just hang on just a second and I'll be right back. Just about to just take the drawer. But uh got snagged him a diaper. There, snagged him some socks. Uh I wasn't prepared for this video at all. Oops, sorry. I need a uh a onesie, a white onesie. I think it look like I've got one of those. I've got them for a preemies. I don't think that boy will fit in a preemie, so we're just going to have to do without a ouch, a onesie. Because his, his outfit is short sleeve. This is why I don't do changing videos anymore. I've never got what I need. And sometimes you have to compromise. And you don't want to compromise on, on camera. <laughs> but every time I see his face and I see uh, uh, Elijah. Elijah just cracks me up just looking at his face. <laughs> He's not all that happy either. I just don't have happy kids. Do we, buddy? <laughs> um, let's see. What's going on? Uh, hubby's still working on the uh, baby patch outside. And, oh, I'm waiting on pa a package. And I've been sending packages left and right. I just, I'm not a good shopper, I guess. <laughs> People expect more than what they get or something. And then there's some people that are just happy to get anything. I'm one of those people. I'm happy to get anything. I don't care what it is. Uh, let's see. What else? It's heating up here. The weather. And I got a feeling we're going to wish we had this rain that we've been getting that we're so sick of. Because I got a feeling this summer's going to be very hot. Oh. I love this outfit. I love Pat Pat clothes. Pat Pat has some of the most beautiful casual clothes. Um, but gosh, the sizes runs runs so big. Um, a size zero to three fits like a three to six months. A three to six months fits like a six to nine, you know. Oh, he looks good in that. I wish I knew how to cut hair. That wild hair just drives me bonkers. I cut until I run out of hair. Call it a day. <laughs> On people, that's, that's okay, you know. 
for a while. I mean, it grows back, but on a doll, it, it doesn't grow back. I love these outfits with the, the stuff on the back. That way, because I like to put my babies on their tummies a lot. And uh, when you got that little scenery on the back, it, you know, it kind of adds to the, to the beauty of it. I'm going to have to find his bell. I don't know where it's went to. No, I'm sure it's in the shoe drawer. Looks like I was fooling around with Sarah Lynn's bracelet last night and the heart come off. I'm like, oh, now I'm going to fix that, which I did already, but. And I think I've told all the news that I've got. <laughs> Never tell me anything secret. Uh, let's see. And that's got it for him. Let's do something with that hair. Make you have and make you a little bit happier. Huh? Sorry about my arm, everybody. There we go. He's a pretty boy. <laughs> yes, he is. I'm, I'll have to uh, put him on a onesie after we get this all situated. Um, here, let's just clip this on for now. Do you take your passy? Yeah, you take a passy, don't you? Hmm? And here's your puppy. Don't he look pretty in that? I think he looks just gorgeous in that. This is a gorgeous doll. You look like you don't have a neck. Uh, that's a little bit better. That's a little better, isn't it? Well, I guess that does it for us today. Um, I'm going to head over to uh, Christy's Reborns. Or, <laughs> Christy at CJ's Little Ducklings Nursery on Reborns.com and see what she's got today. Because her stuff sells so fast, you have to pretty much watch it every day. So I want to run over there and see what she's got before it gets gone. <laughs> she's got baby earrings, baby shoes, baby baby clothes. Um, she's got a silicone for sale if it's not gone already. And you have to, like I said, you have to keep an eye on her, her uh, store because the stuff moves so fast. But Meet me over there. Everybody take care of each other, love each other, respect each other, and always be kind. You never know what somebody else is going through. Plus, it says a lot about what kind of person you are. Stay safe, stay well, and stay blessed. And we'll see you in your next video. Bye.